There's a reason that we're called to do certain work. And I often address the question when people say, what can I do with this degree? I ask, well, what do you want to do? What do you want to do in your life? Is this degree going to help you find and manifest your point of highest contribution in the world? And do you have an idea of your dream job? So I like to start with the dream job and work our way back. So if we begin with the dream job, we know where we're headed, even if it changes through the learning. There are ways I can think of to integrate this learning into every job on the planet. But for each individual student, their own vision of how they want to contribute, of course, is different. So the way we handle this within the program is the program is basically divided into two parts. So the first piece of the program is your content learning. Those courses are Introduction to Humane Education, Environmental Ethics, Animal Protection, Human Rights, Culture and Change. That's the core body of knowledge. The second piece of the program is where we begin to bridge from education to action. So after the students are finished with their core courses, they begin doing their research, they do their electives, they do their internship or practicum, they do their thesis work. And that whole second piece of the program is meant to guide them into, or at least to help them, find the way in which they are going to manifest this work in the world. We have a lot of partners that we work with for internships and practicum. The thesis can be a creative project, a business plan, a curricular project. So when students ask that, what can I do with this degree? It's not a way of putting it back on them to say, what do you want to do? To me, that's the moment where we begin our academic planning. It's very mindful. We move through the program with a dream job in mind. And a lot of people say, I don't know what my dream job is. I want to help animals. I don't know what my dream job is. I want to make sure this planet is around in 50 years. I'm not sure what my dream job is, but I want to address some of the problems that confront humans on this planet. You know, they want to pitch in. There's one thing that really connects the students to this program. I think of it as the golden thread of commitment that runs through everybody. We all believe that education, the power of education can be harnessed truly to affect change, long-term sustainable change around the world. It's putting our education in service of helping humans, animals, and the planet thrive. And that's what they want to do. So even if there's not a dream job, there's often a vision. And we work with that. And we begin looking at how can this be a livelihood? How can you make a vocation out of this that also can sustain you? It's not the kind of thing that we can count on people doing as a hobby or a volunteer. The needs are real. The problems are pressing. So we take that mandate very seriously.